best printers. Whether you are working on an important proposal or cash flow projections for a new construction project, or perhaps even a first draft of your future award-winning screenplay, you know you want it to look its best with clear and crisp letters. That's when you know it's time to buy yourself the best printer you can buy. Whether you need a printer for a small business, home office, or school, it's important to choose a device that makes printing quick and easy. Choosing the best printer can be complex because of the wide range of features available. You might wonder which features are worth investing in and which specs you should pay attention to when comparing printers. The cost of printers varies wildly. Obviously, you shouldn't spend more than you can afford on your new device. However, budgeting for a printer runs deeper than its upfront cost. You also need to consider the ongoing price of replacement ink. It's common for the cheapest printers to have some of the most expensive ink. It's how the manufacturers make their money. So before you go to the nearest Best Buy, do some research online. Make sure the price of the replacement cartridges is in line with other models at a similar price point. It's also worth checking whether you can pick up third-party ink cartridges for your printer and whether you can refill the ink cartridges. Be aware that using unapproved ink cartridges might void your warranty. You can also buy laser printers. They use toner instead of ink. Laser printers can produce sharper images and crisper images than their inkjet counterparts. Which configuration is right for you depends on how you plan to use your printer. If you're going to print lots of text documents with few colors, a two cartridge printer might suffice. People who need professional grade color printouts should opt for a laser printer and regular users can decide between CMYK and Inkwell printers. All the laser printers offer the best quality they are also expensive to buy and have higher running costs. If you're a home user, an inkjet should suffice, but the quality of printout varies significantly among inkjet printers. Several things affect the print quality, including the design of the print head, the printer's driver, and the quality of the ink. However, the main spec to look out for is the printer's dots per inch. It shows how accurately a printer can replicate the pixels of a source image. You can find inkjet printers with anything from 600 to 600 DPI to 4800 by 4800 DPI. We've all sat impatiently while a printer creates a document at a snail's pace. It's frustrating. If you do a lot of printing, especially printing of documents with dozens of pages, print speed will be an important factor in your purchase decision. Printer speed is measured in pages per minute. A printer will have different pages per minute speeds for pages of text and pages of images. However, when you look at a box in a store, you'll often see one PPM rating. It refers to how many pages of black text under the printer can produce in a single minute. Again, you'll find massive variation in the PPM scores of consumer grade inkjet printers. You could come across anything from 5 PPM to 25 PPM. Another major thing you should look out for when buying a new printer is its connectivity. To establish which connections you need, ask yourself two questions. Where are you going to print from and which devices are you going to print from? All printers on the market offer wired connectivity. They can connect to your computer via a USB port. However, some models also offer Wi-Fi connectivity and Bluetooth connectivity. Increasingly, you will find machines that support Google Cloud Print or Apple AirPrint. Bluetooth is great for printing from local mobile devices, while Wi-Fi and cloud support let you print documents remotely when you're away from home. Printers do more than just print. All-in-one devices can also copy, scan, and even send faxes. You can expect to pay a bit more for all-in-one printers, but for many people, the extra capabilities are worth the additional expense. Also, keep an eye open for manufacturer-specific added features, such as special photo print printing modes and web apps. Not all printers can accept legal size paper. Similarly, the scanner beds on many all-in-one printers are too small for legal documents. Some high-end all-in-one machines have a separate scanner feeding tray on top. You can use it to scan larger documents or stack multiple papers and scan them into a single PDF file. Printers come in many shapes and sizes. If you're looking for a printer that fits in a small area, there are now many compact versions available. Sure, you might have to sacrifice the scanner and copy your functionality, but it's a good option for occasional users. At the other end of the scale, some devices are significantly larger. They are normally aimed at the small office market and would be unnecessary in your home. Remember, technology should look great. Don't buy something that doesn't fit its environment. Stay with us until the end because you don't want to miss our number one pick as we count down the five best printers. And before we begin this list, be sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel for more information on list related content just like this one. And don't forget to ring the bell so you don't miss any new lists as we release them. And you can find a link to all the options on our list in the description down below. Now, let's get started.
number five, Brother HL3170 CDW. Number five on our list is the Brother HL3170 CDW. If you want a laser printer for your home or office, the Brother HL3170 CDW is a safe bet, a compact device that you can get at an affordable price. This printer can blaze through jobs at a rate of 23 ppm, and it holds 250 sheets of paper. Both of these factors make it a wonderful choice for offices where people may need to print out a lot of documents without waiting for someone else's job to finish. The printer isn't just fast, it also supports duplex printing for double-sided pages. Whatever you print will probably look great as it can print full-color documents at 600 by 2400 dpi. Setting up this brother model is a cinch, and besides its Ethernet and USB 2.0 connections, it also supports wireless printing. Users can connect with Android or Apple devices, among others. Number 4. Maxify MB5420. Number four on our list is the Maxify 5420. If you run a small business, chances are you need to print a lot of documents. And not just any printer will do. You'll want a printer that works quickly, so you don't have people forming a queue grumbling angrily, and one that can handle the rigors of frequent printing without breaking down. Enter the Canon Maxify MB5420. With its compact cube-shaped body, the MB5420 will fit in any office or house, and while it may not be the prettiest horse in the stable, it can pull a lot of weight. The printer can hold a hefty 500 sheets of paper spread over two trays, and as we noted in our review, it can print monochrome documents at a rate of 22.2 ppm, 10 ppm for color documents. Critically, it can also stand up to a heavy workload. The printer's monthly duty cycle is 2,000 pages, which will probably be enough for any small business. As an all-in-one device, the MB5420 can do more than just print. It can also fax, copy, and scan. And as we said in our review, our scanned documents exhibited accurate colors and fine detail. While it's not the cheapest printer in the world, the MB5420 gives you a lot of mileage for the price. Number 3. HP Tango X Number three on our list is the HP Tango X. For the average home, dorm, or even business, printing needs have never been rarer. Everyone has gone digital and PDFs can easily be signed on our computer, but some printing is still required out of necessity. For those jobs, the Tango X steps in. This tiny printer has no screen and barely any buttons. It does everything by app and voice command, offering compatibility with Alexa, Google Assistant, and Cortana. The printer also has a great color accuracy for printing photos and optimal high yield cartridges for greater flexibility, depending on what you want to print. However, there's no room on this compact model for an automatic document feeder, and it won't exactly win any awards for speed. However, it's safe to say that the Tango represents the future of printing and may be perfect for you right now. Number 2. Epson SureColor P400 Number two on our list is the Epson SureColor P400. Photography is an expensive hobby, and if you've invested a lot of money in a great camera, you may want a printer that can do your photos justice. While you can drop $1,000 on a premium photo printer, the Epsom SureColor P400 offers great prints without the need to tap into your retirement fund. With its unassuming facade, the P400 may not look like anything out of the ordinary, but it houses an 8 cartridge system, 7 colors, and a gloss optimizer that can create prints of excellent color accuracy and saturation. The P400's 7 ink colors allow for a rich variety of shades, and the gloss optimizer gives photos a slick finish that emphasizes the color saturation. The P400 can accommodate paper up to 13 by 19 inches, and while those sheets may take a little while to print, several minutes according to our reviewer, the results are stunning. There may be photo printers with a higher ceiling than the P400, but casual photographers or those still learning the ropes should get the most value out of this entry-level beast. Number 1. HP OfficeJet Pro 9015, the best all-around printer. Finally, the moment you've all been waiting for, number one on our list is the HP OfficeJet Pro 9015. HP has spent a lot of years slowly ironing out the kinks in the office jet line and updating the technology for the modern home or office. The result is the Office Jet Pro 9015, an advanced printer that works very hard to make the printing, scanning, copying, and faxing experience. If not pleasant, then reliably manageable. It has a 22 page per minute ppm printing speed. That's for black and white. Automatic two-sided scanning up to 1200 dpi, a 35 page automatic 
document feeder, and a 25 sheet paper tray. On the printer, the excellent color touch screen allows you to change settings and choose your tools with plenty of options for sending scans to email, the cloud, or a device of your choice with Alexa and Google Assistant compatibility. Working by voice is also an option. Or you can use the HP Smart app, which allows you to control the printer from afar and even monitor your ink levels. That's only the start. You can dig into smart tasks that allow you to optimize a printer for specific programs like QuickBooks. Connection options include major Wi-Fi direct features like Apple AirPrint. If you're printing over Wi-Fi, you'll also get a nice intelligent Wi-Fi connection that monitors for connection problems and fixes itself when possible. Since this is HP, the printer also comes with a variety of security features like encryption and password protection. Few printers have ever shown such quality from top to bottom. Bottom. However, we note that while it's more compact than previous models, this printer still takes up quite a lot of space, so you gotta make some room for it. I hope this countdown of the five best printers was informative and helpful. Don't forget to ring the bell so you don't miss any new lists as we release them and you can find the link to all the options on our list in the description down below. Join us next time for another Top 10 Tech Countdown.